Hello to all my friends out there. You thought my Halloween costume was bad. Well, here I am. Okay, I just got back from the food pantry and I want to show you what I got. And what happened was last night I was buying some uh, stuff at the, um, I showed you the stuff I bought at the um, bazaar. And the guy who worked there told me that today he was going to work at this food pantry and he told me where it was. And so I have this really uh, small income and as you know, I'm extremely thrifty. And I'm thinking, you know, I bet I might benefit somehow by going to this. So I jumped out of bed. I didn't do any, I didn't really comb my hair or anything. And I got up at 6.15 and I went over there and uh, I want to show you the nice stuff I got. And I was really kind of shocked, you know, being such a cheapskate myself. I promised myself that when I got old, that I was going to accept any kind of help I might need. Because when I first got sober alco off alcohol years ago, I caught on real quick that if you want to survive, you have to help other people. And I would try to help people and, and they were impossible to help. And I said, I swear I will never be that way. And so what I got was all fresh food. And I thought of Ellen's Abundant Life on Less. Go to that channel and subscribe. And she's a vegetarian. And so she went to a pantry and she got mostly meat and canned food. But I got this fabulous four bags of food and they even carried it to my car for me. So let me show you what I got. I got a bag of dog treats. My son has two big dogs and uh, they are trained. My son will tell the one big dog to guard the baby and Misha. And he, he lays by the door and he will not move until my son gets back. So I got a bag of dog treats. There's actually two of them and they're the best dogs. And then they had dog food. I thought I'll take that. Those big dogs will. This was like a shopping type of pantry kind of like anyway and I got 12 eggs and I got uh, some milk. So that was fabulous. Then I got two eggplant. Uh, you can go to this pantry every week, but you know, I won't need to go for a, a long time. I got carrots. Uh, the, the, the food is nice. I want to encourage you guys, if you're on a fixed income and you're not exactly, oh, there's another carrot, you're not exactly wealthy, I got some apples, and all you have to do is go, I got a nice little uh, pumpkin thing, I got uh, two squash, I got uh, two sweet potatoes. What I buy is mostly marked down food and storable food. I don't think I've bought this much produce in my life. I got a couple oranges. I got a box of strawberries and I will make some strawberry jam out of that. I got a package of oatmeal. Uh, this this looks good. I want to maybe tonight I'm gonna make some oatmeal bread. I've been going to do that. I got a big bag of kiwis. That's a lot of kiwis. I got um, two cans of Vienna sausages. I eat these a lot with top ramen. Uh, but lately I heard one. A top ramen with mozzarella cheese. Oh, I got uh, three Vienna sausages. And then I got all these lemons. I thought about Ellen. Ellen, I would have 
drove by and got you, but to live in Ohio. Uh, I think this food was Cutter, California. So, um, you can go once a week, but there's just one. This is enough for maybe a month. I got um, a bag of rice and a bag of beans. So this combination of rice, um, beans, and rolled oats will keep you going for a while. I got a nice bottle of oil. So I got uh, eggs, milk, and oil. So that's awesome. And then I got canned food. I got some mango chunks. I got some chickpeas. I could make some hummus. Uh, what I like to do with chickpeas is when I make pasta salad. I have this really good pasta salad. It is um, pasta. And then you can use cheese. But you can also use uh, chickpeas. Sometimes I put olives, carrots um cucumbers whatever i have uh frozen uh mixed um mixed vegetables and then uh some balsamic vinaigrette dressing i got some soup so that was awesome i got some um, cream of mushroom soup i got some cranberry sauce that was awesome i got some uh, sweet potatoes I got some, um, another can of sweet potatoes. I could make a sweet potato pie out of one of those. And then I got this spaghetti sauce. This looks really good. So I got two, four, six, eight cans of storable food. And uh, let me see what the expiration date is on 2025. The last time I got, I did this was a few years ago when I was sick, and I noticed that the cans all had long expiration dates. So I want to encourage you guys, if you're a senior, what's going to happen is the inflation is going to take a bite, take a bite, take a bite, and you're going to be losing your purchasing power. So anything you can do like this, this is really going to help me out. This is a, a lot of food. This is not food for a week for one person. Well, I guess it depends how much you eat. But I was really, uh, really grateful that I went to try it out. And I want to encourage you guys, uh, if you need food, As much food as you can uh, store is really going to help you because we don't exactly know what's going to happen. Uh, probably what's going to happen is the the inflation is going to last at least until after the first of the year. Okay, you guys, please like, comment, and subscribe. And God bless you all. And if you have any tips, any inflation beating tips, can you leave it, leave it in the comments? And um, God bless you all.